stay safe world you already know what's going on we got to talk about this situation with the Yeet fans man the Yeet fans they're going bad man they're going outside for real Yeet's my lord and fucking savior like Yeet bro like if Yeet's gay I'm gay like it's it's kind of funny at this point but basically this one like super dedicated Yeet fan he basically uh he, he had to get the fucking message of the album basically he's tied it on his face man we're gonna get into it and everything, but before we do, I'm gonna need y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. Let's run it up. So, isn't it crazy how there's always that one fan that takes this shit too far? Like, it was all cool, but the Yeet, like, cult fan base is really a thing. This man really got a Yeet too a lot tattoo on his face. Like, I mean, like, I'm not gonna say I'm not a proponent of face tattoos because I literally have a face tattoo and shit. But this man took it crazy and like he he got the fucking album tatted on his face, bro. Like real shit. And I mean, I guess kudos to him, man. He felt too alive. Nothing shows how alive you are with a fucking yeet inspired face tattoo, man. For real. That's all I gotta really point at at this point, cause it's like, bro, he's really doing something. But I feel like this also speaks to his whole like control that he has over his fan base. Sure, his fan base might not be the size of like Playboy Cardi's by selling like 100K or something first week. But he's definitely, I think if he continues this streak and people don't get tired of the music, gonna be continuing to like get bigger and bigger. But I feel like what has to happen definitely for him to get bigger and bigger is people can't get bored of this sound you know like i feel like a lot of people like playboy cardi came out when playboy cardi first like got big and shit in that type of era i'm just using him as an example because he kind of has like a same amount of like shit in the amount of like come up that he's experiencing right now but i feel like the difference between this is playboy cardi he reinvented himself so it's gonna be interesting to see if fucking yeet like fans are able to reinvent themselves or i mean it, it's gonna be interesting to see if yeet himself like can reinvent himself you know after like becoming who he is because otherwise he's gonna be destined to be like Lil pump you know coming out with like two years two solid years of getting money and then falling off basically but maybe i feel like the amount that he is dropping like he might be predicting the fact that he might eventually come like down but at least if he'll have his core fan base like these dudes that are getting face tats with like his shit like he's gonna be okay he's gonna be having like a good fan base that's gonna keep him like lit as fuck for you know for probably life i mean if these niggas getting yeet face tattoos and shit that's crazy i mean maybe he's inspirational man i don't know At, like let me know in the comments what the youth think man y'all fucking with yeet or you think he's overrated or some shit real stay safe shit y'all already know what the fuck's going on peace